Hey guys, today I went to the Alex Pandrea live lecture, the last stop on the tour at Tannen's Magic Shop. Now going to this, I knew I was going to be the only girl, and when I got there, I was right. It was still so much fun, it was just a bunch of magicians showing each other tricks, and partying, and having a good time. It was a free lecture, and they served pizza and beverages, courtesy of Alex. Now the lecture was a Blue Crown event with their CEO and founder Alex Pandrea teaching us stuff, but it turned more into a party than a lecture. We were all just kind of doing our own thing and everyone was just kind of showing their tricks and everything like that. Alex was there promoting the Blue Crown Summer Club and the release of the NOC Knock decks. Now I actually got to talk to Alex, show him a trick, get his autograph, and take a picture with him. I was shy talking to him at first because he was the first professional magician that I ever met. So going up to him at first, I was just like, can you sign this for me? But after a while, I got more comfortable and I built up the confidence to show him a trick. Now I got a video of me showing Alex the trick, but the people who were filming it didn't do it right because all I got was this. Now this wasn't entirely their fault, it was shot with my iPod and it has a case on it that protects it very well. It's two cases in one, it's supposed to be like really protective, it's like sandproof, waterproof, brake proof, and because it can do all that, it has this kind of like cover that goes over the camera lens and you're supposed to just move it out of the way when you film and just like it has this little slit or hole that you kind of hold it against but it comes out and right now it's not coming out but like it does come off when you're filming and I told the people this that there it goes I told the people that there, you have to move this out of the way, but no one listens to me. And that's why the footage was all black. So I decided that I need to just get rid of this because I already broke it, so it's not waterproof anymore, and the purpose of this is to make it waterproof. And I already broke it, so I should have just ripped this off. So I'm gonna do that. Where are my scissors? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh my gosh, I did it. There it is. Gone. I should have done this yesterday. That way I would have visual evidence of me showing Alex Pandrea a trick. But no, I don't have any of that. But it did happen. You wouldn't believe how sad I was. I was so mad. I was just watching. I was going to watch it back. And then it was just like, you guys didn't film it. And I was so upset. I was so sad. But it's like, what can you do now? It happened. But... There's no proof of it. Though, I got a picture with him, which I guess makes up for the video. Not really. But we were just together, and we were in the Blue Crown sunglasses for the Summer Club, which is awesome. Now, the Blue Crown is releasing their new Summer NOC knock decks in orange and blue. And I don't believe they're out yet, and I'm pretty sure they're not. But... Alex was selling them there as, I guess, like an early release because they're coming out soon, but they're not out yet. So I guess it was just an early release for the people who were at the lecture. Now, I got two of the decks in orange and blue, light blue. They're still working on the names, though, and I suggested Sunset Orange and Oceanic Blue. I was thinking, like, beach summer themed, and that's what I suggested. Now I actually even got him to sign the deck right here, Alex Pandrea 2013. Now I got him to sign it on the plastic cellophane, which didn't occur to me at the time, but it can scratch off. Like it was, he signed it in Sharpie, but you could like, if you scratch at it, it can come off. And I was so upset because I realized this after I left. So what I decided was I got a piece of cellophane from a different deck box and I covered it up. So that way it's a little bit more safe. So that's cool. But before I left, I'm so happy I did this, but I got him to sign the blue one on the box. So it's actually 
on the box. It's not going to come off. And I'm really happy I got that because now it's like permanent, not like the one on the plastic. So that's really cool. And before I got him to sign the decks, I got him to sign a card for me. And it's on the Ace of Diamonds. It says, To Anna, that's me. And he has this autograph signature, 2013. So that was really cool, and I'm so happy I got this. And it was awesome. I'm so happy I got his autograph. Oh my gosh, it's just like fangirl moment. Now, before I left, because he signed the decks, I was like, ooh, I can't open them now. I'm, I'm going to be so scared to not ruin the boxes. So I bought two more because I'm just, like, obsessed. And I really like these. These are great. I only have the blue one open because I had to open the cellophane to get the him to sign the box. So this one's open. Now, I really like the deck. It's just really nice, and I love the shade of blue. It's just a nice shade of blue, and I really just like the thin borders and, like, everything about it. Alex also taught me how to, how to card this one. I'm not good at it yet. I think I'm doing it. There it goes. Now, I also got to meet another magician there named Jordi Magomero. I believe I pronounced it right. I'm sorry if I didn't. He was one of the first people I met there, and he was showing me a trick. I got to show him a trick, and I also got a video of him showing Alex a trick. Okay, um, I'm going to show you something, okay? So, if you don't mind, uh, do you want to shuffle? Oh, it's okay. Just take, <laughs> take one card. Oh, so, wait, wait. Every time, sorry, sorry. Every time, that, every time that I perform this trick with this card and this card on the deck, I always fail. Mm -hmm. And because it's, I want to show you something good, I want to take it apart, okay? So right now you can take whatever you want. See it, show it to everybody but me, of course. Mm -hmm. Put it back. And my job is going to try to find that card, okay? Oh, remember that I told you that every time that I use those cards in the deck, I always fail? I fail because every time that the cards are inside, they find the card before me. So I fail because I cannot find it. Oh, sorry, I, I, put, it, I put them back. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's true. It's, it's, it, it happened. It's, it's in the middle of... Oh, sorry. Sorry about that. Uh, for the first time, what, what, which was your card? Five of spades. Five of spades. Oh, it's a five of spades, yeah. Yeah, but you know, I know what you are thinking. You are thinking that probably the queens have something on, on it, so could you please check it out, that they have nothing inside, and they are... I, I'm gonna try it again, I'm gonna try it again, so... I'm gonna try to put the card, the five of spades, between the two queens, okay? It's done. <laughs> nah, it's about joke. It's about joke. One, two, three. Hey. <laughs> and right now you are thinking that probably the five has something. I, I, I'm set up with him. Just check it out. That there is nothing inside that. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Uh, do you know what? Um, would you please uh, give me a. Uh, Put, put it back in the middle. Put it, put it. Thank you that you are putting it like this, because instead like this, you put it like this. Every time that the card is face up against a face down deck, you could put it here or here or here or here or here, but you put it just in the middle of those two cards, right? It always happens. That's why I always take it off. It's between the two things. So, if you guys live in the New York area, you guys should check him out. He is a close-up and parlor magician, and he does shows in Spanish and English. So, go check him out, because he's really cool. So, that was my New York trip for the Alex Pandrea Live Lecture Tour. It was probably the last time I was going to go to Tannins, because I'm not going to be able to go there for a while. So, it was a great way to end off on a good note. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.